area school board members are meeting right now to vote on proposed boundary changes that would force students to change schools. They're expected to vote on two separate plans, including one that would close just elementary school. Eight on your side's Melissa Marino is live from the school administration building to break it down for us. Melissa. Well, hey, good afternoon. The meeting is just getting underway, and I can tell you, probably the most packed we've ever seen it. It is standing room only. More than 50 parents are signed up to speak and express their frustration. The battle over school boundaries has dragged on much of the school year, leaving parents, students, and educators in limbo. This evening, the Hillsborough County School Board is scheduled to take a final vote on a redistricting plan that would expand Carrollwood Elementary into a K-8 school but it would also close just elementary school in Tampa. I feel like we didn't have a say so when it came down to it. According to the district, just elementary is a failing school and only has 283 students enrolled despite a capacity of 600. If approved, Superintendent Addison Davis says students would have the option to transfer to one of five schools. Just Elementary would then be repurposed. So the recommendation tonight is to immediately close it for the 23-24 school year. Parents forced to walk their kids to Just Elementary worry how they're going to make it work if they have to switch to a new school further away. Just is more convenient for me and my babies, and I know it's more convenient for a lot of parents as well, and I know it, it's kind of heartbreaking. Now the community, they're also going to hear Superintendent Addison Davis unveil his latest school boundary proposal. Now this is countywide or district-wide, meaning it could impact 15,000 students. A number of schools, actually more than 100, would be rezoned. I'm going to have more on that coming up at 5 o'clock. Reporting live, I'm Melissa Marino, 8 on your side.